Hello everyone, this is Alex from Tech Media Guys and today's video is going to show you on how to make the DualShock 4, which is the PlayStation 4 controller, work on a PC just like an Xbox controller would. Now the first thing, well, you need to decide whether you want to do it through Bluetooth or whether you want to wire the controller into your PC. You'll have to wire your controller into your PC if you don't have Bluetooth on your PC and I have Bluetooth so I'm going to set it up through Bluetooth but if you're just going to wire it you can skip this step. Now the first thing you want to do search for your Bluetooth settings on your PC and then you want to put your controller into purring mode and what you need to do is hold down the home button and the share button at the same time and then your controller will start flashing as you can see but now you can see the wireless controller is ready to purr click on it and click on purr enter the passcode for your game controller well what you need to do is enter 0000, zero, zero, zero four zeros click next and then your controller should be purred as you can see by the, uh, the light on the controller it's no longer flashing but it's compared to the controller now your controller is connected to your PC so now what you want to do is go to ds4windows.com which is the address here and click on the download now section and then what you want to do is click on the ds4windows.zip file to download it which will then start to download the file you will need a winrar or 7zip to open the zip file now what you can see is two programs here so what we want to do is extract them to your desktop click OK and then you can head to your desktop and as you can see the two files are here this is what it looks like here I'm going to open DS4 Windows okay now that DS4 Windows is open what you want to do is click on app data which will install it on the uh, new update uh, program files so click on that and now DS4 Windows is open and as you can see status Bluetooth it's connected the controller as you can see by the blue light which is now on the DualShock 4 you can see the battery is at 90% and profile is default but what you want to do is go into edit the profile and so now you're in the profile settings well firstly you want to do touchpad is used as mouse which means you can use the touchpad of the DualShock 4 like a laptop trackpad and you can click it for a mouse click and stuff I also click the uh, lower right of the right mouse button now you can also change the color of the um, light bar in real time etc set it to flash at 10% flash red so while charging rainbow you can do lots of settings etc um, so very cool uh, obviously you can change all the settings here, all the map buttons make it work for you but it's very much ready to go out of the box so yeah I've got the controller now I'm moving my thumb as you can see it is moving on the PC and I just opened the program by accident there we go so yeah that's very much it and now when you go to open a game that supports Microsoft Xbox controller it will uh, it will just work as an Xbox controller so I hope you enjoyed the video hopefully you can check out some of our other content and consider leaving your rate and subscribing this has been Alex from Tech Media guys thank you for watching